Today, we're going to draw the, the cube octahedron projected from three dimensions onto the flat plane. So first of all, I've got this beautiful glass marker. I'm going to draw a star of David. So here's my first equilateral triangle. Every angle is 60 degrees equal length. I'm going to interpenetrate this with the same shape, but going through itself at a, another angle, an inversion of it. So that's nice and neat. Now to get the projection that I want, I do need to construct a, a bigger hexagon around it. So I'm gonna start from here to there. That's one line, two line. You can see that that length's the same as that length. Now I need to go, there is a center point. From the center point, I need to put two other points. I need to put a point here and a point there. And those two points define the, the outer hexagon. So that looks pretty good. Now to complete the projection, so we've got the depth, the three dimensional depth, I'm gonna draw from, this, from these six points of the internal Star of David, I'm gonna draw like a wide V shape. So that's one, two, um, three, four, five, and one more here, six. So if you stare into that and just close your eyes a little bit and peer through your eyelashes, you'll be able to get um, a nice um, optical illusion where suddenly the flat image becomes a three-dimensional cube octahedron. You can see here, it has six triangles, uh, six squares and eight triangles. And inside it has 12 internal vectors. It's the most perfectly balanced shape I know in the universe. And it has a beautiful little spin to it.